What the heck is this? Uh, where's my stuff? The gauntlet! I hope Petra's okay wearing it. Gotta get back, find the admin, find my friends! The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Check. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Check. Um, uh... Hello? Hello? Echo? Echo? The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in check zone. zone. Yeah, I heard you. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone, or else they get the lava. She's got it. Point made. Oh, look. An orange line. Bedrock? The admin said a place where I'd never see the light of day again. What is this place? just here to make sure all guests behave themselves. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, yes, Jesse. Welcome to the Sunshine Institute. It's a reformatory for people the admin has found difficult. I'll be your warden. So the admin created this nut hut too, huh? Of course. The admin is an endless source of building brilliance. Including this beautiful behavioral adjustment retreat center. I'm sure we'll get along just famously. Yeah, I don't know if I'd call this place brilliant. <sighs> it is the most brilliant. Y you know he's not here right now, right? You never know. My friends! I need to get back. The admin put his gauntlet on one of them. Who knows what he's making them do? He gave them the gauntlet? Oh, man, lucky them. That means they're the admin's favorite. <laughs> How great would that be? I bet your friend is living it up. Enjoying the high life right by the admin's side. Great? It's more like stressful, dangerous. No two ways around it. It straight up stinks. That's exactly the kind of attitude that got you sent here. And if your friends are anything like you, they'll be making their journey to Betterment right next to you, I'm sure. Now hang on a tick. I have a... another guest on my manifest. Male. Grizzled beard. Hair is described as... majestic. Long... Long list of aliases hey, distract here. Distract him. Yeah, that's Jack. Oh, Jesse, thank goodness I found you. This I place know. is... Let's get out of here. Wait, you can't. It's too dangerous. Stop them, associates! Believe what a mess we're in. And all because I didn't realize Foss was actually the admin. Oh, what a mess. Manipulated, shammed. Hey, the admin fooled everyone, not just you. But I should have known. I should have been better. And now the admin has Petra too. I, 
I don't know how we're gonna get out of this one. Hey, sound the alarm! We don't stand a chance without weapons. Can we run? Where? Wherever they aren't. Stop them! Don't let them reach the burrows! Where we are. What is that? Whoa! Great, more weird monsters. Are those zombies? Thing is endless! Jack? Jack! Jesse, where are you? <laughs> gotcha! Oh, really wish I had that gauntlet right about now. Yeah, maybe not this way. What are those things? A spider? A reaper? It's the stuff nightmares are made of. That is unsettling. Of course, why would there be only one? There's never just one. Oh no, oh no, oh no! in an escape attempt. <sighs> that is just... That is just rude. Take this one to the mushroom. <laughs> and bring that one to my office. Now.
close the door, would you? Do as you're told. Go on. Uh, sure. Obedient. Good. You and your band of misfits may have hope yet. Band of misfits? Oh, let me show you. Radar! Nerm! You see, here at the Sunshine Institute, there are two types of guests. People who make the admin extra angry, such as yourself, and your punch-happy friend down there. And there are people who the admin sends to make sure the first group will be, uh, well-behaved. Your friend, with the glasses, is surprisingly feisty for such a skinny guy. If you know what's good for you, Warden, you'll let them go. Oh, I'm sorry, but threats definitely fall under the category of not well-behaved. Bring up Jesse's leverage, would you? Skinny guy, glasses? Funny story. When I first got here, I was actually part of the second group. We were just a crazy couple of griefers. Simpler times. Oh, this place is filthy! Ah, oh, so disorganized! Ah, making me crazy! Jesse! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay! I was so... I was so worried! I'm glad I'm okay. I'm just relieved that you're okay. Oh, you were worried about me? Meet the Iron Breathtaker. Iron bars to hold the victim in place below. Sticky piston above to shove an iron block down over their head. <gasps> oh, <gulp>! <laughs> now, I said before that you could follow in my footsteps. That could start now. Ready to improve that pesky bad behavior of yours and join the good guys? Work for me as an associate and help bring order to these poor, chaotic individuals. Don't do it, Jesse! <laughs> What's it gonna be? Okay, I'll do it, just stop! Oh, that's so great to hear. <laughs> Oh! Hi! Hi, that was... so dark. <sighs> easy, easy there. Radar, was it? You just had quite the harrowing experience. But don't worry. Our newest guard, er... Uh, associate, will be walking you out. Jesse, no. I don't know how much more of this I can take. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. I did this for you, Radar. I'm trying to protect you. What? No. Well, well, well. Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. Stella, what are... how... Well, I appreciate you letting me out of that ice. I can't let that disrupt the new professional relationship we have now, okay? I'm sure you understand. I knew a day of reckoning would come for my rival. Ah, you two know each other? <laughs> I am just absolutely not surprised. Well, I absolutely am. Surprised you haven't already ruined this place, too. Keep an eye on this one, Warden. Where Jesse goes, trouble usually follows. Now come on, Jesse. No one wants a sour rival. Be like me. I'm a shining example of success. I'd barely arrived and I'm already bossing you around. <laughs> Isn't it grand? Let's go, Randall. It's Radar! Uh, that's what I said. <sighs> Stella's right. Commitment and loyalty to the admin's cause are cornerstones around here. 
The more friends stick together, the harder they make it for each other. So maybe readjust your concerns. There are bigger silver fish to fry than... than... friends. If anyone here needs a friend, it's you, Warden. Ever since the admin sent me here, I... What are you hiding, Warden? Not every prisoner here wears orange, Jesse. Let's go, rival! That's right! Go along, Jesse, to the mushroom! Exactly what I was going to suggest. I'll have your job before you know it, Warden. Be careful what you wish for, Stella. Show them around, would ya? Thanks. Excuse me? <laughs> Who are you supposed to be? We don't have a problem, do we? I need a moment to process. Maybe several moments. Don't listen to her. She's not as important as she thinks she is. Oh, you are certainly one to talk, Jesse. Ta-ta, Jesse! I'll be at my post supervising a more impressive cell block. Don't be too jealous. Or do. I wouldn't blame you. You okay, Radar? Wish I was. I need something to eat. Get my strength back. You're in the right place. Guests make mushroom stew here. Guess I just need some mushrooms then. There's one! Mushroom! gonna starve. Waste away. Oof. No more radar. You don't have anything in your inventory? You're usually so well prepared. Usually. Only I showed up here with no food, no goods, no nothing. Like everybody else. I saw Jack earlier. He might know what to do. So fighting over a tiny handful of mushrooms is the only way they can eat? Mm, mm, yep. Mm, mm. That cookie looks good, dude. I know, right? Wait, did you eat all yours already? What? Uh, how do you get them? <sighs> okay, look. I thought you knew. The guards have a delicate supply of ingredients, none of which are approved by the Take warden. these cocoa beans. I don't have any wheat for you. But I can tell you who does. That pal of Gruesome can set you up with the wheat. He's my source. Don't know why he collects so much wheat. But nobody makes cookies around here without ox blood. Okay, I should be able to reason with the guy. <laughs> oh, no. He's absolutely unreasonable. You're gonna have to remind him that you're an associate and he's a guest. You're learning how to be a cooperative champion. Wait, what? Is that the admin? You are all here to be reminded of your potential. It's a recording? Come on. And I hope you'll see it in yourself, as I do. Because if you don't, well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential, and you just may become the ultimate champion! So, uh, I hear you might have some wheat? I need two of them. I don't know who you've been talking to, but it ain't true. Wheat is considered contraband in this facility, and I am nothing, if not a stickler, for the rules. You know how things work around here. I'm an associate, you're a guest. 
Rose. Oh, you're gonna play that part, are you? Uh, you better remember this. I want special treatment from now on. Yeah, yeah. Hey, come here. Wheat and cocoa beans. All yours, Jesse. No way! I've been down here for too long. I can't stand another second! Whoa! Nothing personal. I'm just mega, mega hungry. Ah, give me that. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm just so hungry. Uh, <clears throat> hello? What's going on in here? Jesse? I expect far better from my associates than this. One cookie's not that big of a deal. One cookie's not that big of a deal. And just who does this contraband belong to, hmm? Whew. <laughs> you all know now that weapons are strictly know, forbidden at the Sunshine I'm Institute. So who does this down. belong right. to? Thing. You might as well just come out and tell me. It'll be so much easier for everyone. Large Henry won't have to pummel anyone. No one will need to be pummeled. I see. I guess the ocelot's got both of your tongues, hmm? Did we let an ocelot into the Sunshine Institute? Is it loose on a tongue-stealing spree? You know that misbehavior means getting sent down a level. And that means... No! Not the zombie mines! Not the zombie mines! Yes. Perhaps a little time harvesting rotten flesh will teach you something. Take him away. Well done, associate. You've successfully apprehended your first contraband. Keep up the good work. At least now I can make a cookie for radar. Well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential. And you just As the associate walked up to Brent, he noticed that the lowly prisoner was narrating all his actions. Uh, yeah. Hi, I'm... The associate didn't have to introduce himself. Brick knew all about the associate named Jesse. The... Jesse was surprised to learn that the reputation of the Wither Slayer, the leader of the Order of the Stone, had spread so far. Brick was curious what Jesse thought of someone who narrated every action around himself. Brick waited for Jesse to say something. I'm guessing this little habit must get you beat up a lot, huh? Jesse had very astute powers of guesswork. So, what are you in here for? Brick remembered the day the admin, annoyed with Brick's constant need to narrate, sent him to the Sunshine Institute to break Brick of the habit. Brick was promised release if he stopped. But nothing will ever break Brick's spirit. He will narrate. Forever. I need to get some food. Any tips? Brick knows that the prisoners fight over the precious mushrooms. But Jesse is an associate. There must be other ways to get food when you work for the man. Ever try to get out of here? Brick didn't want to tell the associate, but Brick remembered the punching that came from the others. Oh, the punching. So Brick decided to tell all. Brick knew that the only way out was through the burrows, a seemingly endless labyrinth filled with monsters and who the heck knows what else. Brick also knew that only one person has ever tried to escape. But Brick never speaks her name. But Brick will never speak of Prisoner X. So Jesse never asked again. <sighs> That's it for now. Thanks, Brick. You're welcome. Uh, Brick told Jesse, You're welcome. Well, it's not much, but hopefully it'll help Radar get his strength back.
Here, eat this. Get your strength back. Thanks, Jesse. I really appreciate... Uh, yeah, sure, thanks, whatever. Interesting attitude there, buddy. I'm gonna have to really step it up. I mean, this is prison. So from now on... I'm prison radar. I'm gonna get my own mushrooms. Make my own stew. Disregard my bedtime. Radar, wait, this isn't you. It's not about me, Jesse. It's about this place. This place either breaks you or transforms you. Now, get out of here, guard. It's time for prison radar to show this world what he's made of. That's right. Come at me, dude. What's going prisoner on? Prisoner X has escaped. I repeat, Prisoner X has escaped. All guests, please report to the nearest lounge. <laughs> Think that's their cute way of saying sell. Yep, you should get in one too. You haven't had your Protocol X training yet. This place just keeps getting weirder and weirder, Prisoner X. Other inmates were talking about her. Something of an infamous escape artist. Rumor has it she even knows the way through that maze. Most people have never even seen her that keep her locked up so deep. That sounds like the sort of person we should get on our side. Agreed. Someone with that kind of knowledge could be very useful. But where is she exactly? She's apparently locked up on the deepest, darkest level of this place. Cell Block X. Uh, detecting a theme with the names. Yeah, they found their groove and they're sticking with it. We need to get to Cell Block X. That Warden seems to have taken a shine to you. Might not be a bad idea to work your way up. Get on his good side. Could be useful. Or a disaster. But hey, only one way to find out, right? Hmm, the Warden does seem to like me. Working the joint to our benefit. Prison Radar approves. Okay, it's a plan. You stay here and rest up. I'm gonna find a way to get us to Cell Block X. Sounds good. While you do that, I'm gonna study this place. Before we're through, I'll know it like the back of my hand. But how to get promoted? That Oxblood guy sure looks suspicious. If I can catch him doing something against the rules, maybe I can get promoted. Secret buttons, nice! Now we're on to something. Now the question is, what do they do? I can do with this. I think there's another room back there. Okay, time to see what tall, red, and gruesome is hiding. Okay, looks like the buttons move the blocks. I did it! Yes! Now, if only someone had been around to see me being this impressive. Hmm. Mm. A mushroom? What the heck are you doing here? Sounded me like I could ask you the same question. Yeah. Mind explaining what you're doing in my most private of spaces? Visitors ain't welcome, and you are most definitely a visitor. How about you explain what you're doing? 
and questioning someone who's about to lose a lot of teeth if they don't mind their tune. If you hadn't noticed, you left the hole open. Now get out of my cell before you regret getting in it. Did I hear mooing? Oh, come on! Excellent work, new associate. You see, this is how you get promoted. Work your way up. But first, to maintain order. This creature cannot be allowed to undo the balance of the mushroom. Shear it, uh, would you, Jesse? But then it'll be... An ordinary cow, yes. You know, bringing back the balance of the mushroom. Now, that was obvious. What? No! Don't do it, Jesse. Not liking your hesitation here, Jesse. You can't. You won't. You do want to be promoted, don't you? Fine, I'll do it. I can't watch. so hard now was it as for you Jesse it's clear you are ready to advance to bigger and better things you've been promoted to the lower levels the zombie mines I get to be your boss now Jesse aren't you the luckiest associate of all now get a move on we don't have all day Zombie minds, Jesse. Every few minutes, a million gross zombies spawn. The equally gross prisoners dispatch them and collect the zombie flesh, which is... It's gross. I, I get it. But why? It's all part of the admin's plan. I, um, you know, I think. To toughen people up. So it makes the admin happy. You have no idea why the admin's doing any of this, do you? Uh, yeah. Well, yes, of, of course I do. Obviously. <laughs> You're just too small-minded to understand, I suppose. <sighs> Though, I suppose, now that we're colleagues at all, I shouldn't leave you completely in the dark. Our job is to supervise the guests as they deal with the endless zombie hordes. Even you could mess this up. Eh, maybe I should knock on wood. Wow, I can't believe this is the Sunshine Institute's idea of a promotion. This is awful. Ta! You! You are awful! You just can't... You... Okay, yes, it's absolutely atrocious. This may not be my dream destination, but at least I'm better off than her. Her who? Prisoner X? You must have heard that alarm before. She was recaptured, but not before taking out a lot of guards. Don't get any ideas, though. Only the Warden's allowed to see her. No, if you'll excuse me. Luna and I are off to prove why we're the best associates.
Hey, what is this? Oh, the big guy, Oxblood, was down for a while and headbutted the wall. Not sure why, but man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Hmm, I wonder what it connects to. Gotta be a way in, but this door won't budge. Hey, don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. And they could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Well, I'm... I'm trying to escape, dude. Plain and simple truth. But you're an associate. Don't you want to get out of here, too? That's, uh, irrelevant. No one escapes. Especially not through that door. Hmm, huh, so that redstone leads to this door. If I can bypass the redstone circuit, I can open the door. What happened? What are you guys doing down here? We couldn't leave you by your lonesome, so we cooked up some trouble and got ourselves sent down too. We're in this together, so we stick together. That's pretty dangerous. Perhaps, but a friend who abandons a friend is no friend. And I am a friend, friend. What did you find? We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Jesse! No fraternizing with the guests. Well, there is someone in here who came from the outside who may still have a hefty inventory. Ah, oh, Stella. some fresh flesh wow you really like that stuff huh nah. oh i love it high in protein high in flavor maybe just a little bit poisonous sometimes but you only live once you sure you don't want some plenty to go around it just say the word your loss Jesse, you can't keep socializing with your guest friends over there. It's bad form. Gross. Yeah, about that. I, uh, need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto. Why exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. You want the truth? I'm trying to escape. As much as I admire you actually telling the truth, there's not a creeper's chance in a cat pack. Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. I had to really prove myself to get this gig as it is. He's just using you. How can you not see that? No, uh, it's, uh, mutual. We're, you know, using each other. I think. Maybe you make some good points, but not enough of them. I have a place here. Respect. Um, you know, a power and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. Yeah, but what about Champion City? You're gonna abandon them? <laughs> Absolutely not. They'll be fine. They will be just, oh yeah, who am I kidding? I have done so much for them in the past, I mean, they can barely make bread without me supervising. Okay, look, maybe this isn't my dream destination. This place is horrible, and I am worried I will never get the smell out of my hair. Here's the cobblestone and stick. But you need to get me out of here. I know we've had our issues, but I also know that you're a hero or whatever. Uh, sure, Stella, we'd be happy to have you. If you're happy, I'm happy. No matter how many worlds I see, it always seems to come back to levers. Okay, 
let's do this. Zombie wave incoming! Prepare yourself! Surprised. Admin? The warden told me you were zooming up the associate ladder. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine? What gives? I don't know if you're dense or what, but working somewhere usually means you don't do things to actively destroy where you work. Not good. Your stupid zombie mines were just the start, Admin. I'm busting out of this prison. Oh, you really think so, eh? <laughs> boy, oh boy, I can't wait to see that. <laughs> Edmund! Sir! I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I I'm ju I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. No, no, not that. Your scar guard, Jesse, is nothing but a saboteur. You were my greatest hope. You were moving up the ranks, and now you've ruined me. I thought you were following in my footsteps, trying to reform. Was that all... all lies? Yeah, sorry about that, Warden, but you kind of work for a terrible person. He doesn't deserve an apology, Jesse. Oh, for the love of... Enough! I'm through letting you disappoint me! And that goes for you, and you, and you, and especially you! And as for you, I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty, to prove your worth as my champion. I suggest you pull out your sword and attack Jesse. And as for you, Jesse, well, I don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun. No! I had such high hopes for you, Jesse. The highest of hopes. You could have been my champion. You gave it all away. Petra, what are you doing? 
I'm so sorry, Jesse. Are you afraid, Jesse? I'd get over it quick. No, I can't. This isn't happening. Serious ouch! Zip it, Jesse. We only got one shot at this. I'm gonna go to the admin, and then we'll both attack him. Just trust me on this one. You're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Uh oh. Ugh. All I asked you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. I don't even want you to be my friend anymore. And I don't want you to be my friend either. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. What about. Prisoner X, what about all of us? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. So I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. What are you doing? This isn't how you make friends. Oh, I think I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm gonna have loads of friends soon. After all. Everyone loves Jesse, right? No. <gasps> no way. You coming? You're back, Jesse. Trust me. I take care of Luna for me. Coming, darling admin! Stella is just the beginning. Your other friends will fall in line, too. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, all of them. Don't worry. I'll take good care of Beacon Town. <laughs> He's gone. Jesse, we gotta stop him! Oh, Petra. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. What? No. You have nothing to apologize for. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. I'm so glad you're all right, Petra. Hmm. Yeah, that was... That was pretty bad. After he took me away, I, I was in this weird place. Time and everything was so strange. I felt like I'd been there forever, and I started to worry you'd given up on me. Hmm. Not to uh, be insensitive, but... You're okay now, right? Not, like, under the admin's control? I mean, duh, of course, I'm, I'm okay. I'm, I'm, I know that sounding this flustered is making it seem like I'm not okay. I promise, I'm okay. I saw Beacon Town, Jesse. They were all worried about you. No one knew where you were or if you were alive. I'm sure the admin's heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot. It's freaking messed up, yo. It's true. Identity theft is no joke. Admin will wish he had never even seen my face when I'm done with him. No one wears my face except for me. We made it! Whoa. Good. Uh. Yeah, 
Talk about some intense security. Just stick close to Jesse, all right? Mm. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Yeah, you guys go on. Get Prisoner X. Oh. If I wanted to imprison the dreaded Prisoner X, that's where I'd do it. I think that's where we need to go. All we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Mm. Come on, I think we can make that jump. Oh. You're up next, Nurm. Oh. Okay, now you, Loon. <laughs> Seriously, how do you do that? Last jump! I'm Jesse. You must be Prisoner X. <sighs> Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I could shove you right into that lava, and you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push. <laughs> and sizzle, sizzle, sizzle! I'm not your enemy. You don't need to threaten me. Yes, but it's so much fun to threaten you. I don't get much fun these days. Look, Prisoner X... Zara! You're supposed to know how to get out of here, right? What? Where did you get that idea? Oh. No one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute. You try to escape all the time. Why would you do that if you didn't know the way out? I get bored from time to time. I like to stretch my legs, beat up a few guards. It doesn't mean a thing. The admin stole my identity and he's running around with my face doing horrible things in my name. I gotta get out of here now. Romeo was here? Just now? Well, um, the admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. You didn't think admin was his given name, did you? That's funny. I call him Slimeball because that's what he is. And a jerk. He has that effect on people, it's true. You must really be something if you made him so mad. He almost never comes down here in person, except to put the Warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more Warden. The admin fired him. That's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping with that little creep out of the picture. So now you want to help any me? Any enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine, I always say. Well, I've never technically said that. I think it sounds pretty good. Oh, so glad you changed your mind. You changed my mind, Jesse. You're obviously a formidable ally. But don't forget, you do need me. I'm the only one who knows the way out. You know the way? Then show me. Let's get out of here. Just one problem. This whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it. Explode? Take a look around. If someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor, these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom. <laughs> That's a stone pressure plate. That means I can't just use a block. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. That's the situation. Hey, you tricked us. You did this on purpose. Well, perhaps I did. But I couldn't be sure you'd agree to do this, could I now? Hello. 
Oh, I hate to be a wet slime about all of this, but we have to get moving. I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon, the trap won't spring. So either the villager or the llama must remain behind. Hey. 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 Nerm, no, you can't do that. Hey. Oh, come on. We seriously don't have time for this. I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same. This nerm? Hmm. Stella did ask me to look after her. Come on, Luna. We gotta go. Hmm. 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 I promise we'll be back for you. Hmm. Hmm. How did you? My straitjacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from. Prisoner X, I presume? Yeah, guys, this is Zara. Zara, the guys. Hello. Where, uh, where's Nerm? Oh, your villager friend offered to take my place so my cell's booby traps wouldn't go off. <gasps> what? No. He... he did that? And you let him? Nerm did it to save us. You would have been proud of him. I mean, of course I, I would have been. I... I always am. <sighs> well, no matter what it takes, no matter how many heads I have to clobber, I will get him back. She better be worth it. Trust me, I'm worth it. Ugh, can we get going, or is the reunion still underway? Yeah, we're going, we're going. Come on. have escaped their lounges! The warden's been fired! <laughs> Zombie meat is back on the menu! When I find that warden, I'm gonna make him pay for what he put me through! Yipes! Wouldn't want to be the warden right now. Every prisoner in this place wants to tear him to pieces. He better watch his back. And his front, and his side. Yeah, lots of watching in his future. I'm worried about the guy. Whatever happens won't be pretty. Well, beauty is subjective, but... Yeah. Not gonna be nice. <laughs> Let's see if they left us any weapons. Weapons! Sweet, sweet weapons! I could take the enchanted iron sword, or the diamond sword with no enchantment. The diamond sword will last longer, but the iron sword is enchanted with sharpness. Not bad, hmm. Okay, definitely feeling better with a sword in my hand again. Agreed. Versatile. I don't know much about llama fashion, but that's a good look, Luna. Look 
looking good, gang. Now let's. You jerks better not have taken all the cool weapons before I got to dig through them. Friends reunited. It's a prison miracle. Even if Jeff is a little uh, completely different. I ought to pound you to pulp for what you've done to Jeffy Boo. Incoming face punch. Look big, red, and ugly. Maybe you should reconsider your emotions right now. Prisoner <laughs> X, oh jeez, I don't want no trouble. I'm out of here. Come along, Jeffy. That was frighteningly effective. Well, now that that's over with, can we get moving now, please? The opening should be just around this corner. We have a situation here. Back! Back! All of you! One more step and it's Kaboomsville! Jesse! Hey! You're wearing a guard's outfit! Well, guards ain't in charge no more. And furthermore, I'm not a fan of guards. So thusly, you're getting beat up. A bunch. Oh, boy. Oh. It's the happy little jerk who didn't like my happy little painting. I'll bet you're not so happy now, are you? Jesse, you freed Prisoner X? Just when I thought you couldn't ruin my life anymore! What in the world were you thinking? Holy crud! It's Prisoner X! I think you've clearly lost your mind. Sorry, Ward. Zara and I made a deal. Did you know she was once an admin, too? The admin had to take her powers away. She tried to destroy him. I promised the admin I'd never let her free, no matter what. And I'll keep that promise. Even if I need to blow us all up to do it! <sighs> Later, Tate. <laughs> Why are you all staring at me? It's making me uncomfortable. So is it true what he said about you? You were an admin? Well, ugh, it's complicated. We want answers, Zara. Fine. Yes, I was an admin. Ages ago, Romeo took my admin powers away from me just before he banished me to this pitiful prison. But I'm not the villain here. Romeo and his little warden were the ones who put you down here, not me! So glare in another direction! I'm innocent! You're just another victim of the admin. Just like the rest of us. And there will be a lot more victims if he isn't stopped. Soon. She's not like us. She's a monster. Wait, so an admin can be stripped of their powers? Ugh, it's not simple, but yes. So what do we... We don't have time for this. It won't be long before Romeo finds out what's happened down here. Yeah, I guess we should keep moving. Follow me. Sorry, Jesse. But do you really trust her? She's not right in the head. Jack, you haven't seen what the admin can do. We need all the help we can get. But her? Really? Do you have any other ex-admins in your inventory? No. Oh. Petra's right. We need Zara's help. It's the only way. I just hope you're not making a serious mistake getting involved with another admin. They're all glowing! They're pretty scary looking, Jesse. Let's be scarier.
many of these things are there? Never just one. Never! Nice work. Thanks, Jack. Skillful. Impressive. Less talking, more stabbing. Just let me think! Think or make something up. Ah! It's fine. Even if there's a setback, we can still get out of this. Not exactly a vote of confidence, but I'll take it. Wait. We can just build to the top of the wall and get to the other side that way. Yeah! Sounds good to me. Wait, where are you going? She ditched us! Guys! Don't come up here! What? Why?
point. was unbelievable and you stuck the landing nice oh that it's just my perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory well there it is guys our ticket out of here that is sparkly the sparkliest is that diamond <laughs> where is everyone that lunatic is gonna be inventory if she's not careful so we should lend her a hand shouldn't we but she sounds like she's in trouble. We're not abandoning her. I told her I'd help her escape. It's time to prove it. You can't just leave her, come on. Oh, I can't believe we're doing this. Zara, come on! You came back. I said I'd get you out, didn't I? Now show us the way. I know you didn't have to do that. I appreciate it. Let's go. I'm not a very trusting person. Romeo betrayed me. I have trouble getting along with others. I'm not much of a people person anymore. If I ever really was, it's gone now. You've been away a while. He'll figure out how to get along with people again. Doubtful. After what I've seen. There's something else you should know. There was a third admin, named Fred. Where is he? Dead. He and I fought Romeo for control of the world. We lost. <sighs> uh... Where's the rest of it? Yeah, how are we supposed to escape? This doesn't even go up that far. That's because we're not going up. We're going down. Down? There is no down. We're standing on bedrock. You can't go any lower. You might think so, but that's where we need to go. Below the bedrock. Everybody knows there's nothing under the bedrock except nothing. And also certain death. <sighs> we're not at the bottom of the world. It only appears that way. I really do want to believe you. Then believe me. I'd rather take my chances in the maze than listen to any more of her lies. Any of you are welcome to join me. That's crazy talk. All those monsters... I don't care! She's an admin. An admin killed Voss, then stole his identity, and then... Remember I told you he took my admin powers away? Well, down there lies the secret to taking Romeo's powers from him forever. Fred, the third admin, discovered it. Jesse, help me dig through this tower. See? I told you. These stairs lead to our salvation. Now there's a good reason to get a move on.
I can't let anyone run around disguised as me or my friends. The amount of chaos they could cause is, well, it's unthinkable. That's why I summoned you. Track them down. Make sure they're behaving themselves. <coughs> Man, oh jeez. Run, 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 Jesse. As fast as you can. 